So in this lesson, I'm going to actually uh, load some pictures from a camera connection kit into my iPad 2. I know uh, in, the, in the past we've used Google Drive to load video in. Uh, had a couple of problems with the uh, video clips that we're using for the next project here. So I had to think of a different way to try to get video onto the iPad itself rather than either downloading from YouTube or um, putting them through Google Drive and popping them on here. So what I did find, and this, is, this will be interesting because I'll use a little picture in picture here from video from my phone. Um, what I was able to find are these relatively inexpensive uh, camera connection kits and I've got in, in this particular case I got an 8 gig uh, card in it um, so I just wanted to show you how the how the iPad responds when you plug this into your your port your 30 pin at the bottom it's got a 30 pin connection if you've got a iPad uh, 4 or higher they do make lightning connections as well uh, for the camera connection kit but since I was using an iPad 2 I, I had to use this particular type of device so there's my camera connection kit I am gonna throw this into the 30 pin port here and you'll see you'll see how the iPad responds once the connection kit gets popped in there and it starts reading the card I didn't touch anything it goes it goes automatic so the camera connection card is in the 30 pin port you don't see any lights on the camera connection uh, kit but that's okay and this this one's pretty cool I'll, I'll show this when I pop it out but as you see on your other screen you basically the album uh, section has come out and has loaded the your photo app um, and then what does show up is the import down at the bottom. You now see an import. And I'm going to go ahead and hit the import. And you'll notice that you've got um, four videos that have popped in. You have an import all. You can select these if you'd like. Uh, so you can pick whichever video clips you want. In this particular case, for my next project, I'm going to grab all four of these videos. So I just select on all four. And I'm going to hit the import command and you see the sprite working and once the video clip comes in you got a green check on each and those get popped in obviously the longer the uh, video clip time wise the more time it takes so then you've got this import complete <clears throat> command or impl import com complete dialogue would you like to delete imported no I want to keep all of them so I'm gonna keep them and now they appear in my uh, in my camera roll under imported photos and videos uh, you've got a couple of other last import and then all imported but in any in any case we've got a copy of each of these videos where I need them and as you all know once they're in the camera roll they are accessible to you in iMovie I'm gonna take a quick second to we're gonna unplug the uh, the shark is what it's called just to show you what this looks like so this particular camera connection kit has uh, you, a couple of slots you get mini mini SD uh, you've got a USB connection if you want and then I've got my card in there let me show you the structure of the card in order to get videos onto the card there's a, a special way you gotta do it okay let's well, see how this looks good I, I've got a little bit of a screen capture here I am going to move some things around here, so sorry about the audio. I'm going to try to slide that SD-RAM card into the back of the Mac. Just so I can show you the folder structure. Here it is right here. It says no name. So I've got this no name idea. Let me slide the uh, folder over so you can see. So this is the SD-RAM card. I've got a, got a manually made DCIM folder. And then within that manually made DCIM folder, you see each of the MOV clips. Again, I name these MVI underscore BRIDG. They got to be no uh, no bigger than eight characters in the names, so that'll give you some idea as to what the uh, the file structure happen has to be on those SD RAM cards in order for the uh, iPad to pick it up. Hopefully, that helps there.